Good morning, Steve Fried in Chicago with the morning grain comments overnight. Uh, prices are sharply higher in all our markets. Soybean oil is up the daily limit, corn is up the daily limit, and all the wheats are up the daily limit. Uh, soybean market, uh, it's up about 50 cents right now. Um, it was at one time up almost 80 cents. Uh, meal right now uh, is up about seven dollars. Um, but in the outside market, it looks like the stock market is going to be 980 lower, dollars 947 higher. Uh, crude's up seven dollars at almost 98 dollars, and gold's up 53 dollars. Um, obviously, the big news overnight was Ukraine invade, uh, Russia invasion of Ukraine. Uh, the first step was um, missiles taking out Ukraine uh, military bases and air defenses. Um, we'll be watching pretty closely what the next step is, but they also have troops in the Black Sea uh, Ukraine export cities. And uh, there is talk about troops moving in from uh, Croatia um, up in the north and, um, and that they later today could be heading for the capital of Ukraine. Uh, we also note that um, markets waiting for any response from the West uh, the initial sanctions uh, did not deter uh, Russia from entering uh, Ukraine. You have to remember that um, Russia is the second uh, largest world wheat export trader, and Ukraine is the fourth largest, and most of that goes to uh, North Africa and the Middle East. The um, Ukraine is the fourth largest corn exporter, of which most of that goes to Europe, China, and Africa. Uh, there is a consensus that Russia and China have made an agreement. Uh, number one, that China will offer uh, needed products to Russia if there are sanctions uh, at discounted prices. In return, uh, Russia will have China's back in case China wants to invade Taiwan. We also had some numbers come out from the USDA Outlook Conference um, in the corn, basically unchanged from their baseline numbers. They look for 92 million 2022 corn acres, a crop of 15.240 uh, billion bushels, and a carryout of 1965 uh, versus uh, most guesstimates around uh, 11 or 1200. 48 million wheat acres, that's down from their baseline of 49 million acres, a crop of 1945, uh, but a carryout of uh, 731. Uh, which is uh, up from their baseline of 703. 88 million bean acres, which is up from 87.5 baseline, a 4.490 4 billion bushel uh, bean crop, and uh, a carryout of 305, which most people have a carryout of 190. So again, uh, the disruption of the export matrices, especially corn, wheat, and sun oil is unprecedented. Uh, we don't know exactly how this is all going to play out. Um, from a weather standpoint, no changes in South America or the U.S. Uh, this is all about uh, uh, Russia's invasion of Ukraine. As always, these are my thoughts and not those of ADM or ADM Investor Services. Have a safe and profitable dating day. And please, try to treat people like you yourself would like to be treated.